welcome. We just want to talk about uh, how to uh, learn how to kick and uh, teach your kid how to kick. Uh, first and most important thing is to uh, select the right ball. Uh, if you haven't got the right ball, you know, there's a whole variety of ones you can use, whether it's a tennis ball, a, uh, a soccer ball, a basketball, uh, to, uh, to get the uh, basics right, uh, you can use any of those at home, so find whatever you can. Um, ideally, you get one that fits your hand, so, uh, you know, there's a, a nice soft one you could have that you can certainly kick inside, even down to a really, really small one. It doesn't really matter as long as you uh, can get it in your hand and practice uh, the skill, so... Right, uh, the balls we're showing you today, a lot of them are the Sharon Precisions, and the reason they've got a line on them is to help both you and your, uh, your kid understand if it's a good kick or not, and it gives you immediate feedback by looking at the spin line. These um, uh, other ones that are made out of synthetic, they also have a uh, point on them so that you can actually look at what you're actually aiming at to kick at and hit that, uh, and if you hit that point of the ball, it'll spin beautifully. So uh, you get the idea of what they're about. Okay, obviously I need to introduce uh, Izzy here, who's gonna help us, and uh, Dylan Shill, you all uh, know from Essendon, and it's great to have him here to help us as well. So what we first look at is the uh, hand on the ball. Spread your fingers as wide as possible, and put it on the side of the ball, and now what we're doing is we're trying to bring the ball down in line with their leg, and I call that in the channel, over your kicking leg. So if it's left foot, it's over this side, if it's right foot, over that side. Now. The important thing is to be able to get good hand uh, connection with the ball. You don't hold the ball all the way down, but you try and hold it as long as you can. So um, just some practice, a little exercises, have the ball over and back, just move it over and back, over and back, up and down, up and down, over and back again. Now muck around with the ball in your hand and ready, go, put it down. Good, muck around again, put it down. Now, while you're sitting watching TV, you can do this a thousand times. Just careful with the ball, control it, and then put it down, and keep practicing that, and I guarantee you'll be a much better kick. Throw the ball in the air a little bit, catch it, get it ready, and then put it down. Now, everyone that kicks that's played a lot of footy, you always have the laces on the outside. So if you catch it and you get it wrong, get it right before you put it down. So if it's facing the wrong direction, always get it so that the uh, laces are facing out. 